I fear none of those things which thou shalt suffer. Behold, the devil shall cast some of you into prison, that ye may be tried, and ye shall have tribulation ten days. Be thou faithful unto death, and I'll give thee a crown of life. Giving all praises to Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Rechel Kodash. Double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone that rule well, and labor in the word and doctrine. Shalom, one minute peace, may that be to the elect of the nation of Israel. Right, you have to recognize the time, the signs of the times, you know, and say it like Paul said to the Thessalonians, you know, you are not ignorant concerning the, the days and times, you know, what does he say, the times and seasons, more specifically. You know, so we've, we've had these things written, but every day we get close to that day. You know, every day that we're on the plantation, every day that we're going, you know, trudging about our normal secular affairs, you have to recognize at the same time, you know, these spiritual things are getting put into place. The Lord is making these chess moves, you know, and every piece, every move counts. You know, it may look like a blunder, but it was a sacrifice. You know, these, the times are getting more and more dire. You know, people are becoming more and more hateful toward one another. You know, as it's written, because iniquity shall abound. The love of many shall, shall wax cold. You know, so iniquity is sin, you know, because sin's going on so much. It's causing a lot of people to lose love. There's increasing divisions, you know, over everything that's happening. And there's a lot on the world stage happening for people to become divided over. But this is all a part of prophecy, right? Get this as well, the reward, Revelation 3 and 10. Because I has kept the word of my patience, I will also keep thee from the hour of temptation, which shall come upon all the world to, to, to try them, which dwell upon the earth. You know, so the, there's two fold to that. You know, two and ten and three and ten are very much linked. You know, but one's telling you about, you know, the ills, and that's what we have to keep in balance. You know, you can't get too focused on the ills, and you can't get too focused on the thrills, if you like. You know, the kingdom, the reward. The thing where where it all ends up, you know, because these, that's what you have to, that's how you keep yourself, you know, manifest on the right track, you know, rather than the wrong track. You have to remember what can, what could go wrong, you know, if we abandon this faith, and you have to remember what there is to gain if you maintain, you know, keep the faith until the end, the crown of life, you know, coronum vitae rather than coronum morte. You know, there's a lot of crowns. <laughs> there's a lot of crowns. There's a lot of crowns going around, you know, but a lot of them are incorrupt. Sorry, a lot of them are corruptible. We're looking at the incorruptible and make that very clear again. There are a lot of crowns that people are trying to look for. A lot of, you know, get rich quick schemes and this and this and that. But all of that, you know, is going to be corrupted. You know, the silver, the gold, all that heaped up and away. You know, it has no linking to the money that you're chasing after. But all that's going to be heaped up, you know, for the Messiah to get. So right now, the riches to be trying to strive and get into is the the riches of wisdom. Excuse me. So like a DJ. Right, the riches of wisdom. That's what we need to be seeking. Seek the kingdom first and his righteousness and all these things should be added you know food clothing shelter you name it you know but everyone's put their put the fresh the flesh a priority put the flesh first and you're gonna <laughs> if you sow into corruption you shall reap corruption going back to that word there again so the only way to get the incorruptible is to be occupied in the things that are meat they're convenient, occupied in prophecy. You know, making learning your addiction. Not making the folly of this world, you know, the, the foolishness of today's, you know, excitement. Something that you, you focus on, that your priority is. Nothing wrong with entertainment. You know, you can get your entertainment in a, in a you know, a measured manner. You know, you don't have to be doing this you know, 25-8, that's unrealistic. You've got, you've got downtime as well. But at the same time, you can't get absorbed by that. You, know, you can't make TikTok your life. But at the same time, you know, there's things in entertainment that will bring you back. 
you know, to remember in the scriptures. It might remind you of a certain scripture, remind you of a certain prophecy. You want to watch a film, whether you watch one of those so-called apocalypses, you know, apocalyptic films, gets you in the right, you know, spirit of prophecy. Again, it'll remind you of these things. But your occupation has to remain in that, you know, which is seeking that crown of life seeking that incorruptible because anything else in this flesh is bound to die well right bound to die you know you cannot put your trust in anything in the flesh that is so the trust has to go to your how about hashem your shy trusting that if you're maintaining a pattern of good works as it speaks about the young men should then your, your bit is done. You know, and then the Heavenly Father will keep his promise. He's not a liar. You know, he said, my servant shall eat. You know, but you shall be hungry. You should be in hunger. My servant shall drink. Yet ye shall be thirsty. So which, which group do you want to be a part of? <laughs> you know, if we really believe it, let's do it. Let's do it, let's do it. Let's maintain a pattern of good works. You know, let's maintain staying within these scriptures. You know, constantly eating, eating that word, drinking that living water, eating that bread of life, eating that lamb without spot, without blemish. There's your house shy. You know, eating the word. Eat that little book. You know, and go and speak into the house of Israel if that's your lot. But remember the crown, man. Remember the crown. Right next video, Lord willing. All praise to Yahweh, Bahasham Yahweh Shai, Bahasham Rukhav Kadash. Shalom.